Hello everyone, and welcome to my The Young and the Restless official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. As Summer Abbott sided with her mother over him, according to teasers for The Young and the Restless, Kyle Abbott was ready to divorce her. Ultra Charles and Kyle leaped straight into bed. Nevertheless, will Kyle have a change of heart now that Summer is prepared to move on? Summer Abbott and Kyle Abbott always reconnect in the young and the restless spoilers. Summer and Kyle have a long history together, according to spoilers for the young and the restless. Notwithstanding their frequent ups and downs, Summer and Kyle's romance is still ongoing. Notwithstanding everything that has happened to separate them, these two always seem to come back together. Though, let's face it, Audra has primarily used Kyle to achieve her goals, even though their relationship has grown closer over the past few months. It seems that Tucker McCall and Audra have entangled Kyle in their web. Undoubtedly a source of pain is Audra's sexual relationship with Tucker. It's just not a joyful finish for this relationship. Spoilers for Y and R. Kyle Abbott and Audra Charles are addictions. Their relationship is meaningless between Audra and Kyle. Their sexual relationship is excellent, without a doubt. Audra is not prepared for the day when Kyle will demand more. It will come eventually. Since Audra is not a suitable mother, Kyle wants someone who can spend time with his son. Presumably, Kyle too misses having Summer at home. Summer is becoming closer to Chance Chancellor, but she hasn't thrown herself into another romance just yet. After the purported death of Phyllis Summers, these two have become closer. Chance's presence has become increasingly important to Summer. In case Summer needs a shoulder, Chance appears to be just around the corner. The young and the restless. Is Summer Abbott going to steal Chance Chancellor? I can almost feel Summer telling Chance how she really feels. But Chance and Sharon Rosales have been dating for a long now. With Chance's shooting, things have gotten more intense. Will Summer admit how she feels now that she might miss the opportunity to talk about her feelings? Summer dating someone else might be too much for Kyle to handle. Finally admitting that he doesn't want to lose Summer could make Kyle feel envious. Will Kyle come to his senses and desire to keep his marriage intact at some point? Will Summer ever return to Harrison Abbott and will Kyle be able to reunite him with his family? According to Monday, November 13's Young and the Restless Teasers, Adam Newman will attempt to have an open conversation with Victor Newman, telling him the truth about his prior plan of retaliation and the reasons behind it. Victor acknowledges that part of the reason he set the trap was because he thought Adam was planning. Victor will mention that there might be more conflict between Adam and Victoria Newman if Adam takes on the role of COO now that Nate Hastings is no longer there. Adam will get wary of constantly trailing his brothers in the Newman throne succession, and there's also the question of whether Nick Newman would rejoin the corporation. Melody Thomas Scott's character Nicky Newman will be criticized by Victoria for not opposing Victor's plan. Victoria is going to call Nicky out for her quiet, since she was actually afraid that Victor would help. Claire Grace will tell Nikki in private that her aunt broke her arm and would require assistance for a few days after she interferes. Given that Oregon and Napa, California are close by, Nikki will offer to let Claire go with her on the Newman jet. Nikki is going there since Casey Reed is holding a seminar there in the Napa region. Since Nikki intends to surprise her sister, she will propose that Claire be dropped off at the airport. Nikki's good act will be appreciated by Claire, who will then ask if she can try her luck with one more request. Claire will be curious as to whether Nikki would visit the lake house and meet Aunt Jordan, because Nikki's aunt is said to be such a huge fan of Nikki and everything that she has accomplished. I'm sure Nikki will find a few minutes for that, and she'll update Victor on all the info later. Victor will persuade Nikki to go surprise Casey and meet Claire's aunt even though she will momentarily ponder cancelling the trip owing to the chaos caused by the Newman family. Claire will, nevertheless, wear a look in private that betrays the fact that nothing is as it seems. Nikki is being tricked into a terrifying trap since it's obvious that Claire is up to no good. 
Nick Newman is rumored to be considering returning to Newman Enterprises after Sharon Rosales informs him about Chance Chancellor's medical problem and summon Newman's Allison visit to his room. Admittedly, Nick wanted to hear Sharon's opinion first because he had promised to support her with Kirsten Incorporated. If need be, Sharon will be comfortable operating alone because she is happy with how her most recent endeavor is progressing. By and R spoilers indicate that Sharon will offer her support because Nick appears to want to be there for his family. Adam will eventually run into Nick outside Victor's office, where he will inform him that their father has left for the day. When it comes to his brother, Nick will express his unwavering mistrust and keep Adam in the dark about his thoughts regarding his future at Newman. Victoria will be at the bar in the jazz lounge, where Nick will later find her sitting in Victor's chair. After talking about what Nate might do next, Nick and Victoria will talk about whether Nick will rejoin the family business or not. Victoria will then ask questions. According to previews for The Young and the Restless, Victor will soon have to deal with more instability at the company, so keep an eye out. Spoilers for The Young and the Restless indicate that the Newman traitor will be revealed. Potential hints are circulating on social media. Spoilers for The Young and the Restless, Newman traitor revealed. Spoilers for The Young and the Restless claim that the traitorous Newman will be revealed. Online, there have been some speculative theories. Exposed, Newman traitor, who will it be? I'm interested in the response, because it seems like everyone under observation for this is acting in an equally suspicious manner. I can't help but wonder if any of those are actually being investigated. Fans reacted on the thread. Some people must be wondering if Sally Spectra or Sharon Newman is the Newman traitor, or is it someone who nobody would anticipate? I could see it being Mamie, maybe she will make it look like Nate so she can get him back to see Dali. A fan commented, it is not Sharon or Sally, in my opinion. That would be against the interests of both of them. The hypothesis, I'm thinking there is no traitor at all, was put forth by another user. Spoilers for The Young and the Restless suggest that there might not even be a traitor. Victor Newman might be experiencing the early stages of memory loss. So far, all the other suspects appear to be in agreement. It could be Claire Grace, the enigmatic young woman from Oregon who showed up in Geno City. Lie and R teasers. Is there a traitor in Nate Hastings? Is Nate Hastings a traitor? As some fans question, it is possible that he has been secretly collaborating with Audra Charles. Spoilers for the young and the restless imply that they might be traitors. It's also possible, though, that Victor is only sensing that someone is trying to turn on him and that isn't a traitor. His four children genuinely worry about Victor. Nothing negative has been shown to the audience regarding Victor or Newman Enterprises. The plot should unfold like a mystery with a real traitor on the loose. Nothing indicates that a traitor may exist. At this time, I sincerely doubt that there is a traitor. One admirer wrote, Victor is either paranoid, or he really is having memory issues, or both. So what do you guys think about this update? Let me know in the comments below. And if you like my videos, please press like and subscribe for more. I'll see you guys next time.